Yeah, Halloween is super fun, but I always have such a hard time knowing where the scary movies are gonna be streaming. We weren't talking prior to what you just said. Why did you start the conversation like that? Halloween Kills was a Peacock streaming exclusive. Now it's nowhere to be found on the app. It's almost as if Michael Myers was like, I'm done making a kill in here. Time to head over to HBO Max. Which is kind of ironic because that app will probably be dead within a year because of poor management structure. Earlier today in the movie, I watched you take a bite of your Nestle Crunch bar with the wrapper still on. And you didn't even hesitate to continue eating it. It's almost like everything happening in real life means nothing compared to what's going on in your fantasy world in your brain. And I swear these companies are listening into our conversations. Just last week, I was talking to my best friend Turnip about where to watch The Butterfly Effect 3, and lo and behold, today I go and check the app, and it's MIA, it's gone. And now my only option is to purchase it outright on Amazon Prime. Coincidence? Probably. Out of all the movies you could watch, why go with the Butterfly Effect 3, Revelations? Also, Turnip? Is that someone's name? I guess out of morbid curiosity. Well, I can save you some time and trouble right now and tell you it's terrible. Oh, I've seen BE3. Don't call it that. I'm just curious if it gets better on a third viewing. Turnip says it does, and it is the third movie in the saga, so it just makes sense. As the expression goes, the third time's the charm. Right amount of times needed to enjoy it. I mean, it's one thing, I guess, to not notice the first few bites of a candy bar with the wrapper still on, but to eat the entire thing without even batting an eye? I truly think you need to get checked out. You need help. And I don't just mean physically because of what you ingested, but also mentally. I genuinely think there's something wrong with you. Between Amazon Prime, Hulu, HBO Max, HBO Snacks, K-Pax, Disney Plus, Apple TV Plus, Paramount Minus. That's also a plus. Why would it ever be a minus? Also, HBO Snacks? That's not a thing. And K-Pax is a movie starring Kevin Spacey and Jeff Bridges. Netflix, Crunchyroll, Peacock, TikTok. Not a movie streaming service. I was talking about the hit song by Kesha. That makes less sense. There are way too many streaming apps and no way for me to manage where I get my frights. Maybe manage your life first. Go outside, make new friends that aren't named after vegetables. Get a job, take a shower, find a strong female lead to settle down with. And for the record, I do agree with you. It is really annoying trying to find the platform that contains the movie you want to watch. I'll drink to that. That's a bar. Take off the wrapper this time. I am. You're not. I'm big.